to my channel. What is up? Kamusta kayo lahat? Comment down below. I'd love to know. Okay, so today's video is going to be the well-awaited EB LTD liquid lipsticks. Wait, let me hold them in my hands. Ayan! I will be doing the swatches and review for these liquid lipsticks. I have worn each shade like for one whole day or for its lifetime, its lifespan of magnalas just sucking lips. I've worn each shade to give you like a full in depth review talaga. I have eight shades kasi ito lang yung mga nahanap ko dito sa mga department stores dito sa Cebu. So, alam ko meron pang, I think, dalawang shade. I think 10 or 12 shades yung available. Pero, wala ko nakita nung iba. So, ito lang yung mga nakita ko. So, sila lang yung magawa ng review and swatches. So, um, wag na tayo magpaligoy-ligoy pa. I think yung pinaka gusto niyo makita are the swatches. So, siguro, yun na yung una kong gagawin. So, let's move on to the swatches. Pshh! charge my camera. Bakit medyo nag-story time ako? Okay. Anyway, um, 
pinagpahinga ko na yung lips uh, pinagpahinga ko yung lips ko kasi medyo marami <laughs> ang mga sinwatch ko na liquid lipstick so medyo masakit sa lips no so ayan wala akong lip product lip balm lang and let's move on sa review dito sa mga liquid lipsticks now all the shades as in lahat ng walong shades are very very pigmented like isang swipe pa lang like one swipe goodness talaga sila as you can see oh one swipe, super opaque ng color as in, as you can see, it's very pigmented, very rich in pigment, and bangang bangga. By the way, yung EB Advance, meron din silang first na release na ano, liquid lipstick, pero hindi sila LTD. Um, I do have all the shades, and gumawa din ako na review and swatches ng mga first release nila na liquid lipsticks. So, kung gusto nyo mapanood ko yun, I'll put the link in the description box below para just in case you're interested. So ngayon, ang pag-uusapan natin ay yung mga LTB liquid lipsticks na EB Advance. Tignan nyo naman, super opaque talaga silang lahat. Like, one swipe goodness nga, gaya ng sinabi ko, one swipe coverage. Isang ganyan mo lang, kukulay na siya sa lips. Una pala, let's talk about the packaging. It comes in this plastic, like, packaging right here na maliit na tube. Super similar dun sa first nilang ni-release na liquid lipstick. So, ito yung first nilang ni-release na liquid lipstick. As you can see, similar lang sila ng packaging. Clear yung body niya. So, makikita mo talaga yung actual shade inside. Tapos, yung kaibahan lang is yung cap nito. Lahat ng shade, white yung cap nitong original na liquid lipstick ng EB Advance. Tapos, yung LTD liquid lipstick, makikita nyo na for each shade, yung takip niya is parang uniform sa kanilang lip color talaga. I like yung actual shade ng lipstick talaga. So, mas gusto ko yung packaging nito kasi mas madaling mahanap yung shade. Kahit na nakalagay lang sila sa iyong parang lipstick organizer, mas madaling makakahanap ng shade na gusto mong suotin for... Suotin? <laughs> Bisaya. Gusto mong suotin for that exact day. So, I like this packaging a lot more. Yung mga ganito na packaging ko from EB... EB? Yung mga ganito liquid lipsticks ko kapag nahulog sila, hindi naman sila nagbe-break. So, it's okay. Medyo durable naman sila. Hindi sila madaling basag and plastic lang sila. Next, sa baba, nakasulat lang dito yung shade niya, tapos batch number, meron ding manufacturing date, which is, oh my god, I can't see. I think it's August 2016, tapos this contains 5 ml of product. By the way, I purchased this for 180 pesos each, which is a good price. Same lang din itong original na EB liquid lipstick. So, I think that's a good price range. Yung Sansan, 180 pesos lang din sila. So, pretty competitive yung price ng EB LTD liquid lipstick. Alright, now let's move on to Alright, now let's move on to the applicator. So, it twist mo lang siya to open and makikita mo that it comes with a itty bitty doe foot applicator. Super ikli lang ng doe foot applicator, guys. Um, actually, the same lang din ng size sa doe foot applicator ng original nila na liquid lipstick. As you can see. Diba? Same size lang sila. And then, yung scent niya. It smells really fruity, like very sweet scent. Hindi siya yung typical na smell ng liquid lipstick na yung parang cotton candy or yung vanilla. Ito, sweet siya and fruity. Yung consistency ng liquid lipstick, as you can see, I don't know if you will be able to see, pero yung consistency niya is medyo thick. Hindi siya same sa other liquid lipsticks na watery or runny yung consistency or super thin yung consistency ito medyo thick siya medyo makapal medyo creamy yun yun yung word medyo creamy yung consistency niya by the way you can find this sa mga EB advance counters sa Watsons or SM department stores or other department stores minsan nga meron sa grocery may mga EB advance counters okay now let's talk about the application yung application ng liquid lipsticks na ito walang kahirap hirap di ba nag start nga ako sa kanyang opacity and Kitang kita naman. Super opaque niya sa aking hand. And sa lips mo, super easy siya mag-glide sa lips. Yun nga lang, this itty bitty doe foot applicator makes it a bit hard to apply the liquid lipstick on your lips. Like, very evenly. Especially dito sa top lip. Kasi, ang liit-liit nga niya. Tapos, medyo mahirap siyang hawakan. But, after using it a couple of times, you actually get used to this itty bitty doe foot applicator. So, it's good. Especially if you're used to using mga ganito, yung mga maliliit. Like, yung sa Sansan, Pinky Skull, collections or dito sa original na liquid lipstick ng EB kung 
sanay na kayo dyan, siguro this will be a breeze for you. Pero kung sanay kayo dun sa mga mahabang doe foot applicator, it would be a bit hard for you to apply your liquid lipstick with this very, very short um, applicator. Pero sana yan lang yan. Okay lang yan best. Kapit lang best. Masasanay ka rin. Now, as I said, for the product itself, hindi yung wand, yung application process is very smooth. No tugging whatsoever sa lips as in very, oh, very heavenly lang application. It's not patchy whatsoever. Yung isang, isang. Yung isang shade na napansin ko na medyo merong patchiness ng konti is this one in the shade Rich Vino. I don't know kung napansin yun dun sa swatches ko, pero I tried my best to make it na hindi siya patchy tingnan. Pero nung first application ko sa kanya, yung first coat ko sa kanya, medyo patchy talaga siya. So I had to go over it with a second coat para ma-fix ko yung pagka-patchy niya. So, yun lang. Yung rich vino lang. Yung medyo patchy tignan. Pero, madali naman siyang i-fix. Just apply a second layer para maging uniform yung opacity niya sa iyong lips. Diba? Bongga. Alright. And then, um, gusto ko rin siya kasi ang daming shades na papagpipilian. Kaya lang, yung kulang sa kanya are the nude shades. Now, this one is actually a very nice nude shade. This one in the shade Cashmere Blush. Um, nakita ko sa ibang tao, like sa ibang YouTube videos, na mas nude tignan sa kanila itong Cashmere Blush. Pero sa akin, I don't know, siguro sa aking skin tone, it looks super bright. <laughs> Medyo bright talaga siya tignan sa akin. Na kung papipiliin nyo ako kung ano yung mga favorite kong shades, <laughs> hindi ako makakapili. Siguro I have three super favorite shades. And, uh, actually, nahihirapan akong pamili. Gustong-gusto ko silang lahat. Siguro yung pinaka-favorite ko talaga are Fire Opal, um, Chocolate Truffle, of course. I love the brown. Tapos, I love Pink Pearl. And, I love Moody Merlot, or Merlot. I love Soft Cinnamon. Uh, siguro, in order na lang ng gusto ko. Cashmere Blush. Tapos, Jet Setter, and Rich Vino. Last yung Rich Vino, kahit maganda yung shade niya kasi patchy nga siya at first time application. Okay, so yung iba naman, kahit nung no one layer lang yung ilagay mo, super ganda na ng opacity niya. Very uniform yung kanyang opacity sa yung lips. And kung tatanungin niyo ako kung kiss proof ba siya, my answer is, you have to wait for it to really set. At least in my case, I tried to wait for it to set for about 2 minutes. Kasi diba yung usual na formula ng liquid lips, stick like color pop or yung jazzy friends na medyo watery yung consistency niya you just need to wait for it for about two minutes max and magiging super kiss proof na siya magiging dry na siya but for this one i tried to wait for it for about two to three minutes hindi pa siya kiss proof i tried to wait for it for five minutes hindi pa siya kiss proof seven minutes hindi pa rin i waited a full 10 minutes and medyo kiss proof na siya pero yung outline ng aking lips medyo basa pa rin so siguro you need to wait for 15 minutes talaga para maging kiss proof talaga siya well at least for me sa way na pag apply ko sa kanya or siguro baka pa lang yung lips ko kaya mabagal siyang mag set sa aking lips but yun yung aking experience sa lahat ng shades same lang sila lahat. And madali lang siyang matanggal dito sa inner part na yung lips. Especially if you eat oily food. Pero kung hindi man oily food yung kakainin mo, pasado pa rin after isang kain, okay pa rin yung itsura na yung lips. Tapos napansin ko, kahit na matanggal na yung inner part na yung liquid lipstick, you can do the spreading technique like ganyan. Kahit na liquid lipstick siya, kasi nagiging creamy siya ulit kapag kumain ka. So after you eat, spread mo lang yung liquid lipstick ganyan, magiging okay na ang itsura na yung lips. No need to retouch. Pero syempre, it's not going to be that vibrant as how it initially looked like before you ate. Tapos one more thing, kahit na hindi ka kumain, tapos you have oily skin, yung dito na part ng lipstick, makikita mo medyo magiging shiny din siya. Tapos itatry mo siyang i-kiss proof test after a few hours, makikita mo yung dito na part ng liquid lipstick dito sa outline na yung lips hindi na siya kiss proof kasi makikita mo parang nagmix yung natural oils ng yung face tsaka yung dito outline ng liquid lipstick <laughs> sa yung natural oils it's so weird bago yung mix sila tapos magiging makintab yung outline ng yung lips pero um, for me it's okay so you just need to blot that away and magiging super okay na ulit siya what else oh by the way nagta transfer siya like sa yung straw if you drink or sa yung baso sa yung spoon fork sa yung pagkain nagta transfer siya. so kiss proof lang siya guys hindi siya drink proof or eat proof
No, dito sa mga shades na to, kahit na sinuot ko sila whole day, especially yung red shade, kahit na sinuot ko siya whole day, wala akong napansin na feathering outside my lip lines, which is very, very good kasi. Yung talaga yung problema with, like, dark shades. Medyo nag-feather siya outside the lip lines. So, bongga! Na-impress ako dito kasi walang feathering na ganap. Oh, and one more thing. Kahit na after mong kumain, tapos natanggal na yung liquid lipstick sa inner part na yung lips, um, you can go ahead and reapply or retouch with this one right away. Na like, hindi mo na kailangan tanggalin yung old layer ng liquid lipstick bago ka makapag-retouch ng bago layer. Pwede mo siyang apply agad-agad kasi hindi siya nagbibitak-bitak sa iyong lips. Kahit nasa pawan mo yung old liquid lipstick na nasa lips mo for the entire day ng bagong layer, maganda pa rin siya tignan. Para lang bagong pag-apply lang talaga. Para lang initial application yung itsura niya. So, yun yung nagustuhan ko talaga about this one. Kasi hindi siya matrabaho na liquid lipstick. Tapos hindi rin siya tacky sa iyong lips. It's not sticky whatsoever. And wala lang. Nagustuhan ko lang talaga itong mga liquid lipsticks na ito. And I'm so happy that I got all the shades. Hindi ako nang hinayang na pinili ko lahat ng shades na ito. And if I find some new shades, especially nude shades, bibilihin ko talaga sila agar-agad. Nang walang pagduda-duda talaga. Wala yung pagduha-duha na eh. May nakalimutan ba akong bagitin? I think wala na. Kung may nakalimutan ako or may questions kayo about sa mga lipsticks na ito, just comment in the comment section below. I'll be happy to answer all of your questions. And also, kung nagustuhan if you enjoyed this video or if you enjoyed watching, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click that notification bell to help this post carefully to become a butterfly. <laughs> um, comment down below if you have any comments. Nyo. I love reading your comments and I always reply to comments. And again, thank you so much for watching you guys. You light up my life. <laughs> and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye! First, na ninerys.